uh, the el over the uh, elbow over elbow, hand over the elbow fits. What we're going to do is we're going to walk our feet out. Notice how my feet are coming out. What this is doing is it's allowing me to wind up and use the structure of my body to very easily shrimp. So I'm using this shrimp-like motion. Walk, walk, walk. I get the angle and then I come in. Some of you might want to come over here to see what I'm doing. Notice how I'm maintaining my frames right here with my elbows as I get them inside. My next, uh, my next goal is not to turn like this so that he can seek to take my back, but instead what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take my bottom elbow and wedge it in front of the knee here. As we're able to do that, we're going to enact the principle of elbow knee connection, which is the essence of guard retention. We're bringing that knee to my elbow and we're able to turn it. As we get the first knee, uh, the first knee in, it's not that hard for us to cross frame and then re-pommel our knees in, okay? So we're gonna start with this Everything motion. in tight. We're not having our arms out here loosey-goosey or anything like that. I walk my feet to the opposite side of where my elbows are going. So I'll walk them out, walk them out, hip in. I create instability. He's on one knee. This forces him to have to be on this knee. I get this elbow right in front of his knee. And then what I'm doing is I'm bringing this knee as I push out with my elbow to bring my first knee inside, cross frame, scooting out. I can reconnect. We regard. Okay, let's get that going. Three, two, one.